gets to know that Miss Johnson is a pet trend expert. And she's going to tell us about the next big thing for your beloved pet. All right, Christine, let's get started. I wanted you to tell me I saw this uh, uh, term, Super Zoo, connected to you. What does that mean? So Super Zoo is the the largest and most comprehensive uh, trade show for pet retailers in North America. We're going to be joined shortly by over 20,000 pet professionals exploring over 17 football fields worth of pet products. This is where the professional pet community comes to discover the latest and greatest pet trends that you're going to see on your shelves in the coming months. What you are seeing. What am I seeing? Yeah. Uh, yeah, well, okay, so one of the trends that really pops out as you're walking across the show floor is that pet parents are treating their animals more and more like members of the family. And I think there's no better example of that than this new board game from Westpaw. Uh, it's a, it's a, board game called Dog's Best Friend Board Game. Uh, and in it, your dog is actually a player. So, you can finally invite them to your family game night. Uh, but it's not all just fun and games here at Super Zoo. We also care very deeply about our pet's health. And the trends we're seeing in pet food echo what we're seeing in the human world, which is fewer artificial ingredients, cleaner ingredient panels, and single ingredient treats like this line from Barkin. They use a single ingredient in each in each type, uh, no artificial ingredients. So it's really great for dogs like mine that have food allergies or sensitivities. And uh, when you're you know, eliminating those preservatives, you have to be more mindful about food storage. So we're seeing more products like this from Cadet, which is a, a vacuum sealed food storage container. So it completely vacuum seals all of your dry food in there. So you can buy that preservative free food without worrying that it's gonna go bad. Okay, so tell me about the spending part. Is that on the rise for pets or pet uh, accoutrements? Absolutely. So Americans every year spend about $100 billion on pet products. Uh, and so that spending is, is on the rise. And one thing that pet parents are willing to pay more for, especially those millennial and Gen Z younger pet parents, is sustainable products. And we're seeing sustainable practices being adopted across the show floor by companies. A great example of that is this line from Jiminy's. They use an alternate protein source, which is crickets and grub protein. Farming insects is much more sustainable than traditional protein sources like beef or chicken. They use less resources like water and land, generate fewer greenhouse gas emissions, and they're actually very nutritious for your dog. So that's great. Another great example of, of a mission-driven brand is Project Suds. Uh, they are a line of hair and skincare products for dogs and cats. Uh, they yeah, use absolutely no plastic. Uh, they reduce their packaging as much as possible. They even donate a portion of the bat of every batch of soap to the local community. So it's great for our pets and great for the planet. It must be so exciting to be there. Each year I do a consumer product show, and that's exciting. But I can only imagine the innovations for pets and their parents. Oh, this is really cool. Tell me about AI and tech. How is it reaching into that world? Oh, yes. Uh, I feel like AI is all anybody's talking about these days, and we're seeing it here on the show floor as well. Over here, I've got an automatic cat feeder from Pet Kit. It has a built-in camera with AI-powered video recording, so it can sense when your cat is nearby, when it's eating, whether it's playing, and it automatically sends videos to your phone. And it can even sense how much food is left in its tray, so it avoids overfeeding your cat, avoids that food waste. And then another tech product that caught my eye is this pet activity tracker from Honeywell, which is like a Fitbit for your dog. It fits on like a collar, uh, senses their activity, their calories burned, all that good stuff. Um, and it also has GPS technology built in. So you can set up a geofence around your yard and get an alert if they ever go outside that boundary. So it's great for their health and also for their safety. Oh, I gotta get one of those for my daughter's dog. I love that. These products that you're seeing, is there anywhere to go online and to get in for Because I know there's got to be a vast amount that we're not covering. Oh, yes, yes. Uh, this show is for the pet professional community, to, for retailers to come to discover. So if there's any of those out there watching in particular, please learn more at superzoo.org. Have fun, and thanks for stopping by the Valder Baby Show, Christine Johnson. I appreciate that. Thank you for having me.
Hi, I'm Valder Beebe, host of the Valder Beebe Show. We have over 1,000 videos on ValderBeebeShow.com and YouTube.com slash Show. We upload new videos daily. Our site is a modern baby boomer platform with news and information important to boomers. Subscribe to YouTube.com slash Show and stay connected as I interview the world's most fascinating people.